In 1922, a sociologist named Ogburn cataloged all the major discoveries that had been made to that point, the top 100 discoveries. And in every single case, the discoveries were made by more than one group simultaneously. And he and subsequently others began to think about why that might be. And their conclusion was that most discoveries, in fact, are a product of a set of advances and a set of questions that have more generally arisen prior to their doing their work. Progress in science isn't necessarily about having an idea that no one else has had. Rather, it's recognizing a really great idea and deciding to focus your energy on answering a particular question. My name is Jeffrey Friedman, and I'm the head of the Laboratory of Molecular Genetics. We study the molecular mechanisms that regulate body weight. About 20 years ago, we identified a new hormone that we named leptin that's made by fat tissue and plays a critical role in maintaining body weight and body fat levels at a constant level. Now that, of course, then raises another question, which is how and where is the decision about whether or not to eat made in the brain. The behavior is highly relevant to a major medical problem, which is obesity and diabetes. I was a graduate student at Rockefeller. What's notable about this program is it really focuses on laboratory research. If you're making your career as a practicing scientist in a laboratory, you're always having to learn new things largely independently. And I think the culture of this program encourages you know, people to think broadly and learn what they need to know on their own. I would say it's not at all unusual, in my laboratory at least, for someone to come forward with a set of ideas or a set of experiments that I hadn't thought of before, and I would view my role in such cases as helping them to implement that plan and do the best experiments they can do. The most important decisions you make as a scientist are based not necessarily on a unique idea that no one else had. Rather, it's seeing an opportunity in the form of an idea that many people may be contemplating and instead investing whatever time, energy, passion you can into trying to answer a specific question.